just wonder if I'm, if me, Jim Harrington, if I'm an echo off of another life. I used to hate seeing people's photographs that had a long description, but I started realizing that all of my photographs, my best ones or my favorite ones, or at least what I was interested in, uh, completely demanded big, long stories. And I also shoot a lot of these old musicians. Some of them are famous, but a lot of them are not. But they're kind of great, you know, these old rockabilly, you know, guys from the 50s or something. I've sort of stayed under the radar in these weird ways, sort of put my toe in the big fancy world. I've kind of kept it over here doing my personal stuff. This was one of my first kind of job. Peter Murphy was playing at the beautiful Wiltern Theater. There were other photographers, you know, and it's like, oh, this is kind of stupid. I walked past this one guy and he's got these, you know, back in the 80s, they had these canvas backdrops that had these kind of new wave painting on it. Everybody had them except me. They were so shitty. And I remember Peter Murphy finally coming in and he's set for the first photographer and he kept looking at me like, what the hell's this guy? I think we all have kind of a responsibility just to, you know, look at the world and engage with it. I think that's the difference in all people is that, that perfectionism and obsessive that draws you to do it. Even when you don't have a boss telling you, it's just you telling yourself, that, you know, there's a whole night of really hard, boring work, but I'm gonna do it because overall I love the thing. You know, it really seems like the 20th century was the, just the highlight of everything. Music, art, architecture, clothing, design. It's like, is there anything that wasn't at its best in the last century? Uh, you know, I, I wonder if, if that's going to be kind of a real important part of the history of this world. And if we're all just falling apart now, that death will be a, a crucial part uh, and maybe the best part of the new way that it's thought about.